My name is Tina Flaherty, class of 2008. The question is, if a spherical balloon is being inflated at a constant rate of 10 inches cubed per second, then at the instance the radius is 2 inches, at what rate is the radius growing? So we're going to start by writing down what we know. We know that the, vol the volume of the balloon is changing at a rate <laughs> of in term dv dt, so volume is changing in, um, with respect to time at a rate of 10 inches cubed per second. We also know that we want to find the rate that the radius changing when r equals 2. And we are trying to find the rate that the radius is changing in terms of time. So we will start by writing the volume equation of a sphere. Volume equals 4 thirds pi r cubed. We chose the, this formula because in the end we're going to be trying to find the rate that the volume, or the rate that the radius is changing. Um, but this formula will <laughs> let us plug things in. <laughs> okay, so now we are going to derive this formula in terms of time. So dv dt equals four-thirds pi, because that's just a constant, so it stays the same. And then we have to derive the r, r cubed, so three r squared. And then we need to multiply, we need to do the chain rule, so we also need a dr dt. Okay, then these threes cancel out and we can now plug in what we know because we know dv dt already equals 10 and then we have 4 pi and then we know r because we're trying to find r it when r is 2 so we plug in our 2 squared and then we only have one variable left which is dr dt which is what we want to find so that's good and we can then solve for dr dt. So we're going to have oops, 10 over 16 pi equals dr dt. So the radius is changing at a rate of 10 or 5 eighths pi inches per second.